Hai, Assalamualaikum dan salam sejahtera bersama saya si Idris dalam sesi 1 Topik Hit. Ok, to begin with, observe the following photos and state the similarities. The first photo shows a group of friends sitting around a campfire during camping. Second photo shows a very dry and hot desert. The third photo shows a boy is having a fever. And the last photo shows a woman holding a cup of hot chocolate. Now, if you observe all the four photos carefully, you notice that heat is present in all four photos. So what is meant by heat? Heat is a form of energy and the unit is Joule. Now, let's take an example of a mother who is giving her baby a milk. Unfortunately, the milk is too hot to be given to a baby that will cause burn to his tongue. So, the milk is put into a cold water to reduce the temperature. So, what happens next is the thermal contact takes place between hot milk and cold water because there is a transfer of heat between hot milk and cold water. A few moments later. The temperature of milk now has been reduced slightly and thermal equilibrium is achieved. Thermal equilibrium is conditioned when two objects are in thermal contact and there is no net heat transfer between them and the temperature of both objects are the same. Let's come back to a photo of a group of friends sitting around a campfire. Do you think thermal equilibrium exists between the fire and the people sitting around it? Okay, that's it. The recap for session 1. I'll see you again in the next session. Until then, Assalamualaikum Warahmatullahi Wabarakatuh.